ask Tom on home show. Wanda from Yak Cats, Oregon, has a ventilation question. Yeah, she does. She watched a video of ours, Tom, and this is where her question comes from. Wanda writes, I have a small home on the Oregon coast, or Oregon, um, with no venting system to the roof due to the cathedral ceilings I have. Uh, I need a new roof, and the contractor insists I let him build an elaborate and expensive venting framework before the decking and shingles go on. I don't want this added structure and added risk with the soffits and ridge vents to allow possible water penetration. I, am I totally wrong in this, Tom? No, I wish I could ask her one question. How old is the, actually two questions. How old is the house and if you've ever had any problems? Uh, probably the answer is the house is several decades old. And the reason I say that is she needs a new roof and roofs last at least 20 years unless there's some kind of damage from hail or trees or something of that nature. And secondly, she probably never had a problem. So just keep it tightened up, put it back together. Don't start recreating the wheel on this house and you get another 20, especially with a new roofing, probably 30 years out of it. And I know for me, that would be long enough, but I'm not sure how old she is and how long she's gonna stay in the house for that matter. But just tighten it up. Here's the one thing, you don't add any ventilation. You keep it tight because it's a cathedral ceiling you don't want that, especially in Oregon, that humid, wet, uh, mucky air going up in there and just nowhere to go. Then you start having problems. So no soffits, no ridge vents, make a insulation sandwich, get it nice and tight, no roof leaks, and leave it at that. And don't, do the, don't uh, invest in the extra expense. And this is a good example of what you've said many times uh, about insulation in particular. It, 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 there are different needs for different parts of the country. Yeah, and then sometimes you can't have the ideal thing, so have what's been working. And there's a, a rule here, you either ventilate it really well, which is nice, or don't ventilate at all. Don't do it wrong, either do it yes, or don't do it at all, or do it right and don't do it at all. That's, that's really a rule to follow. The right way to get the answer you're looking for is visit us at homeshowradio.com. Click on that blue Ask Tom button. It takes you to this page here, to the Ask Tom page, and you fill out a form, send it in. We'll answer it. That, that's what we just did here, and we're going to do it for you, too, because Tom likes to answer a new question every day, and we post them at homeshowradio.com and our Facebook page, and you'll find them on our YouTube channel.